appreciate all, uh, all of everything you've communicated with me. I still can't see how people are going to go to Yellow Pages. I'm going to stay on the internet. Internet, huh? So you're saying people don't use Yellow Pages anymore? No, I don't think so. Well, you know something? This is what the book does. It's going to sit there. It's going to sit there for a day. It's going to sit for a week. It might sit for a month. It might sit there for nine months. Until that person who needs a transmission or the car repair from your shop. So what that person is going to do, they're going to grab this book. They're going to open it up. And they're going to find a transmission repair person to service their car. The people who look at the yellow pages are your most valuable prospects for new business. These are the people who have the money, who have the ability to spend the money, who will influence their friends and neighbors. These are the people who have the cash money they can afford to put a transmission in. Now the usage of the yellow pages, this person right here, with the last four months has received 172 calls. 172 calls. Wow. So you're trying to tell to me that nobody uses yellow pages? There's 172. This guy's laughing all the way to the bank. Yellow pages does work. You know, some people do the internet. And that's great. We have an internet site. Yeah. Uh, I use the internet more often. I think all the people who use the internet, they buy things. Well, you can say all minus 172. 172 well, people true, use this heading. And this person is the fourth, the fourth ad down. So that's incorrect for you saying that everybody uses the internet. Now, what do you purchase on the internet? Well, you said you mentioned the internet. Food. Well, jewelry. Jewelry. Clothes. Clothes. Okay. Do you know what the average purchase on a, uh, the purchase price? Purchase transaction on the internet is $24. The average purchase transaction through the yellow pages is $500. Do you know what the conversion rates are 1 to 3%? Here, one call is one call. On the internet, it's all searches. So the next time that you purchase something on the internet, clothes, toothpaste, bubble gum, remember, the average purchase transaction is $24, the average purchase transaction is $500. If you think about it, who do you think is going to buy a transmission online? Is that going to be a trusted, reliable source? I, so, know, I know a friend of mine, his name is William Harley. Mm -hmm. he, uh, he bought three transmissions online, but now I hear you because... I remember that William had to return him back. Hmm. That's a difference right there. Huh? That was a quite yep. a bit of risk because I hear you, my friend. And think about the, the time he said the return, the inconvenience, and what happens with all that added in. He could have went to you, he got his transmission purchased and fixed, and he'd be better off. Sign me up. Thank you very much.